We were the only province in this nation that streamed as early as grade nine. Starting in September, grade nine students in Ontario will no longer be streamed into applied or academic course paths. Education Minister Stephen Lecce made the announcement Wednesday as part of a four-year strategy costing $200 million. A modernized curriculum that uh, also emphasizes some of the key competencies that are necessary uh, for young people. And the fact that this curriculum is more than 15 years old, I think, underscores the necessity to make it to ensure it is modernized and reflective of the uh, job market. The new grade nine math course will place an enhanced emphasis on things like financial literacy, coding and data comprehension. The curriculum will also include strategies intended to help students recognize their emotions in an effort to build healthier relationships with the subject. The minister also saying that doing away with separate applied and academic courses is also intended to reduce barriers for marginalized students or those struggling with the material. It has disproportionate impacts, adverse impacts on black racialized indigenous students, disproportionate levels of children uh, being streamed down. As a part of the implementation, teachers can expect mandatory training with a focus on anti-racism and discrimination. At the same time, the minister also trying to belay concerns from parents who worry high performing students may lose opportunities to excel. It's going to make a big difference in improving the math scores of those at risk while also maintaining the integrity and the high standards for those children that were excelling. We think that it, that could really provide an enriching learning environment by integrating that those students together. Meanwhile, the Ontario Secondary School Teachers Federation says in principle they support the move but are worried about implementation. Look, my recommendations would have been announce this months and months ago and, and actually create some planning time for it and, and as it's you know now too late for that, uh, postpone the implementation a little bit, provide time for proper professional development for the educators who are going to implement this. This is the first time the grade 9 math course has received an update since 2005. As for what happens when those grade 9s get to grade 10, we're told to expect more updates to come for those higher grades. In Oakville, David Zura, City News.